to Galatians chapter 3, verse 3. Just one verse today. How foolish can you be? After starting your lives in the Spirit, why are you now trying to become perfect by your own human effort? When religion enters into our life, we begin to think that by doing certain rules and doing certain acts, religious rules and regulations and duties, that somehow we improve our spiritual lives. I want you to understand, all of the spiritual growth in our life is a response to the Spirit working within our lives. At some point you have to realize, yes, we, we put works with our faith, and yes, there are decisions that we need to make, but we have to understand in life that God didn't change us because of the works of the law, because we, we did things by our human effort. God changed us by a work of the Spirit in our life. And God will perfect that good work He began in our life also by a work of the Spirit in our life. Now, yes, there are decisions that we need to make, and there are, are, are things that we don't do in life, and there are things that we do do in life, but we, we do not look to religious duties and religious rules and things as how we improve the quality of our spiritual life. There is a fruit of the Spirit that grows within us. Can I just encourage you today? Quit trying to do things in your own human effort, and when things need to change in your life, let me say this again. Quit trying to change by human effort, by your own willpower, by your own self-help process. And when things need to change in your life, come to God and say, God, can you work on me? Father, in the name of Jesus, would you let the work of the Spirit flow in my life and change me? I want to be more like Jesus. Let God work in your life by His Spirit. Don't try to do things with your own strength.